Welcome back to Gadget Girls. Are you or someone you know the type of person who always has to have the latest in music gadget accessories and love showing them off? If you said yes, then this night's Curious Gadget just might be for you. At first glance, it may seem like you are playing with building blocks, but this unique gadget plans to bring listening to music to a new interactive level. Designers at the Holen Institute of Technology have created what they call music blocks. In its concept phase, these wooden blocks have the ability to change the song, volume, or album with the twist of a block. Pressure sensors in the main block detect the weight of the other blocks that are placed on top. This is what increases or decreases the volume. Only the main block has electronics in it, while the other four blocks are made of wood and tin strips. The tin strips are what change the song track. And turning the second block will make that happen. Take a look. The music blocks act as a remote control and can be connected to your computer or your stereo. The object of this gadget is to find a new way to interact with your music. It can also be an excuse for an adult to go back to playing with their wooden blocks. If you're looking for more of a grown-up toy, then check out what Carolyn has in store for you. She was in studio with the makers of Impulse from Molerta, a new cell phone accessory that has users on the edge of their seats. This gadget boasts to unlock the potential of your phone by extending its functionality to a smartwatch. Take a look. Have you ever missed an important phone call because you couldn't hear your phone ring or feel it vibrate? Well, not to worry, we're here with Eric Mijakowski from Alerta, and he's going to tell us all about the new Impulse Watch. This BlackBerry accessory is going to make sure you never miss an important phone call ever again. Eric, tell us how this watch works. Well, the Impulse smartwatch works by connecting to your BlackBerry or smartphone via Bluetooth. Oh, okay. So, for example, if you feel in your pocket that you're getting a call, maybe something's vibrating, your watch will immediately start vibrating as well. And oh, on the nice. screen, you can see if there's a new call or a new email or a new text message coming in. Now, this is perfect for those times where your hands are absolutely strapped. You know, you're holding several grocery bags at once. Your phone's ringing and you're feeling like, oh, I got to get that. But really, if you just looked at your watch to see who's calling, you can kind yeah. of pass it, it off till later. It basically lets you make better time management decisions. So tell me about the underlying technology within this little device. Basically, there's a microcontroller that sits inside this watch, which is connected to all the different components. So we have an organic light-emitting diode display. Fancy stuff? Yeah, it's a low power and low energy, and it makes it so the watch can actually last for a good week on one battery charge. Oh, wow, that's pretty awesome. And we also have a Bluetooth chipset as well, and the microprocessor is the brains behind the watch that allows all of these components to connect together. Nice. So show me how this works. Sure. The watch works by um, displaying the message that you just received on your BlackBerry on the screen here. Okay. So, for example, um, when you get a new text message, the watch vibrates at the same time as your BlackBerry and up pops the person who's sending you the message and a little bit of the message. All right. If you click one button, you can instantly see the entire text message right on screen. And it's really clear, actually. I'm impressed by this. Yeah, it has enough characters to display also a Twitter message, for example. Oh, very nice. So besides showing my text message and phone messages, um, can I utilize this as a real watch? Yes, it does work <laughs> as a watch as well. It, uh, it lets you see the time, lets you set alarms, it lets you set calendar updates. But it's also really cool as a travel watch because instead of having to reset your clock every time you get off the plane, yep. you, can just, <laughs> yeah, you can just let it synchronize with your BlackBerry. All right, that's amazing. And where do you think this technology is going in the future? What is your company going to look at next? Basically, your BlackBerry has a connection to the internet, and we're aiming to build devices that open up that connection to the internet onto other things. Oh, so we're looking nice. at using different display technology like e-ink to reduce the power consumption, mm -hmm. and we're looking at making it much smaller. Obviously, this is a bit of a big watch right now, yep. and we'd love to make a bracelet version that's much more sleek and, uh, and thinner. Oh, nice. Yeah, I'd like to have one of those bracelets, that's for sure. <laughs> that's what I like to hear. Well, mobile accessories have definitely come a long way, and with the technology we've seen today, you will never have to miss another important phone call, email, or text message ever again. Thank you, Eric. No problem.